It's another massive cabinet reshuffle. Really give my counsel and advice. Some new faces and some back from the recycled data bank. But with Lesotho undergoing major national reforms, all eyes will be on the security sector. The new Minister of Defence says he's up for the task. But I've been a minister before. Um, I've joined the politics of Lesotho. And I've seen challenges surrounding that ministry. Uh, there's no need to table them, but you, you, we all know there have been challenges in, in that ministry. Uh, but I'll try and make sure that uh, I stabilize the ministry. In August, Lesotho will have to present a convincing progress report on reforms, while on the other hand, political parties are already on campaign trail for national elections due mid next year. It's really a crunch time for Prime Minister Majoro. He has to make tough decisions. Who he replaces can determine what is likely to happen in Parliament. Him filling up the seven vacant posts and other deputy minister can actually determine whether he is about to face another vote of no confidence in parliament or this is a move that can actually entrench his existing government until 2022 elections time. Rabelang Khatebe, SABC News, Maserolo Soto.